Yes, sir. All right, so we're decorating today. There's Lobby. So we got a scarecrow. We got to figure out what to name her. All right, yeah, it's decorating time. All right, I have a couple of visions. Well, first of all, this is a pillow. And so is this. So we have Halloween themed pillows. All right, um, okay. Oh, dude, I got, so I got Peach a costume, but I can't show you yet because it's not Halloween. I was thinking of wearing this too. Her sister was a witch. Does that fit? Okay, so I got these um, fabrics because I had an idea, which I don't know if it's even gonna work. So I was gonna take these fabrics because they kind of look bloody and spooky and I was gonna cut them into like dripping blood shapes and drape them over my prints. So it looks like blood's dripping down these pictures. Oh, speaking of blood, hold on. Don't worry, it's not anything bad, but this was my kit of special effects makeup. So for those who are gonna probably ask, yeah, it was vegan. It was interesting doing this. So that's what it looked like. And there's some other supplies in here. I'll keep it. I don't know, might need it someday. Okay, so I got this wreath. Is that what it's called, a wreath? I was thinking of hanging this up somewhere because this is festive and kind of spooky a little bit. I got this guy. It's like Dia de los Muertos themed. Really love him. So we gotta hang this guy up somewhere. A little bow tie for Senor Turl. So this isn't his costume. I actually got him a proper costume, but I wanted his him to have a bow tie for today's stream. I just staple it to him. Does he look good? There we go. I got these zombie legs and I was thinking of sticking them in some plants. So they were just like sticking out of some plants. Where's my table? What the hell, dude? He still looks stupid, ugly, dumb, and idiotic. Are we talking about Turl or me? Cause honestly, you're probably right about both. Let's try this. Trying not to hit his root. In fact, I could probably actually just... What do you think of that? Does that work? All right, that's one. Can't even tell that it's not in the soil. Monster uh, plant, nice, that was pretty good. Where does the other one go? Just stick it in the couch. It's coming out of the couch. That's dumb as hell. We need to figure out a place for the hay bales. Hay place, a place for hay. Oh my God, this hay is like hay. Oh my God, it's so messy, dude. Whatever, nothing a vacuum can't fix, right? There we go. Oh, nice. Really adds to the I'm at a fair or a pumpkin patch vibe. Idiot, sit up. Your allergy's about to be on level 9,999 from hay. Wait, really? Lit. Where do we put this lady? I think Bunny's gonna really hate this fucking thing. There we go. Sheesh. I need to find a spot for these, the, these wreaths. I guess I could put this one like right over here. Good thing it's not hay, but it's straw. Oh, is it straw? That's fake, right? It's like shiny. That's not real hay. It's real? Is it? Should I eat it? Did you read the tag? Oh, that's a good idea. Let's read the tag. Oh, it just spilled everywhere again. One straw bale for decorative use only, not for human consumption. Well, to each their own. Oh yeah, here's a pumpkin. It's not a real pumpkin, but it says happy, happy Halloween. This is asking for it right here. That's asking for it. Sheesh. All right, so I wanna do the blood paintings last. I think I wanna hang the wreath. Okay, this should be good. Is that dumb as hell? How does it look on the regular cam? Wait, that kind of looks sick on the regular cam. It's backwards? <laughs> GG's. Cute little Halloween themed orange blanket. I'm gonna put on the couch for a bunny to tear off the couch. Tuck it in. Pillows with hay all over them, dude. There we go. Can you please hit the floor with a vacuum once for me, I beg? God, dude. Jenna actually even said, you should put something down for the hay. And I was like, nah, it'll be fine. <laughs> it wasn't fine. It's actually looking definitely more fall in here, right? Ooh, Peachy likes the blanket. She likes the blanket. 
All right, now we gotta do the real arts and crafts. I think I wanna have the blood come down like halfway, like right here. We're putting trash bags down before the mess, right? Um, so, welcome to the floor. Oh, you know what's crazy is it's perfect. The length is perfect. I'm just gonna cut like right here. Right now I just gotta cut down the middle line. What'd you say? All right, perfect. All right, so now we just gotta get kind of creative with it. So I think I'm gonna use the fabric marker and draw blood and then I'll just cut outside where I draw. Draw on the back. Damn, chat, you're smart, that's a good idea. All right. Okay, so we're gonna start right here. Send it. Can you even see it on the front? Oh, dude, the back was such a genius idea, chat. Holy crap. So now I can cut right on the marker. I don't have to worry about cutting it out. I feel like an X-Acto knife would be better. Say hi to the second camera. It's fun fact, it's a secret about me that I don't really talk about, but I do breathe to survive and things. Ew, oh, okay. There's some dad scissors. Boy, those better be fabric scissors. Okay, here's why I think they're fabric scissors. Look at this. It's got the little measurements, measurement things, measurement marks. That would be for fabric, right? I don't know how else to tell. Now that's for cheese. Okay, that's jail. Cutting cheese with scissors, dude? Jail. Whoever, whoever told me that their wedding is gonna have a pad tie station, I wanna do that now. <laughs> so, Kai. You might get an angry phone call from Jenna. I forgot which is the top and which is the bottom, dude. Boom. Oh, we're not done yet. We still have one more little thing to cut. We're close though. Done. Dude, that's fun. That actually is fun. There we go, there we go. Looking nice. All right, so I literally, dude, it was gonna be very janky, but I was thinking of just taping it to the back of the canvas because I don't want to like ruin the canvas. So let's try that. I changed my mind. When I was replacing my mic back onto my chest, I found duct tape, which is what is currently on my chest. And I think duct tape is the move. So I'm just gonna replace the tape that I currently have with duct tape. Easy peasy. You know what I'm saying? Sheesh. Okay. Fun. What gave you the inspiration to drape fabric like that over the prints? Literally, I don't even know, dude. I just, I just thought about it and I was like, cause these prints are so big on my wall and they take up such a, I don't know, prominent real estate spot of my stream that I couldn't not do something to them. Hi, thank you for, um, for the decorations. Otherwise it would have looked like, you know, too plain or whatever. Okay, I think we're done. So, but now we got to figure out what orientation this shit goes because I do not remember. Oh God, you're gonna have to help me chat. So there's one. Oh God, I'm gonna zoom out. Like which one's first, which one's second? Is this the right order? Like how does the painting or the, the image look? Swap the end ones? Okay, we'll try this now. How's this look? Are we done? 
Are you sure, dude? Okay, yeah, no, you're right, you're right. How's it look? I can't see. Does that look sick? Oh, well, I'm kind of hyped with how it turned out. That is fun. I'm glad that turned out well. It took a long ass time, but we're good. Well, that's done. Piece sticking up on top. Oh shit, you're right. Nothing all scissors can't fix. All right, beautiful. Beautiful. I'm trying to think of if there's anything else we need to do, but dude, I'm proud of this. How long did that take us? Under three hours? We decorated. We did it to him. Do one last little peek around the room. We got the bloody paintings. We got the Dia de los Muertos little wreath with some blood. We got orange blanket and Halloween pillows. We got lady in the back, which still needs a name. We got real hay with a leg sticking out of the hay and the monstera. And we have the black wreath on the mirror. And now we have Little uh, lobby, hobby lobby.